A lot of women want my body. Michelangelo's got nothing on me. I'm a body sculptor, but people are questioning my gender. What? And I never wanted to look like a man. Why would I want to be a man? I want to look like Superwoman. I want to look strong, you know? I may have more muscle than a lot of guys, but I still consider myself very, very feminine. I'm gonna show you how I can be strong and sexy. Before I started losing weight and training hard, I didn't like my body. I didn't even want to look in the mirror because I knew that I was big. I didn't like the way I looked. I didn't want nobody looking at me. But after about three to four weeks of just doing cardio, 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 I seen a major difference. And that's when I got really excited. I didn't notice the masculinity building up. I think the first time I noticed was when a boyfriend of mine, every time he would try to impersonate me, he would do it in a very masculine way. Like if I said something and I was like, oh, why are you doing that? He would say, why are you doing that? But also my attitude was changing. I was walking different and I was like, slamming things down. I'm slamming my bag down off the ground. It made me say, wait a minute. Something might not be right here. It made me feel sad. It was tough because fitness was my savior and it made me feel so good. But as I started getting criticized for having all these muscles, you know, they started saying that I was masculine and it was devastating. People are questioning my gender. I never wanted to look like a man. Why would I want to be a man? I want to look like Superwoman. I want to look strong, you know? I started getting comments online that really, really hurt. It made me not want to go to the gym anymore, for real. I didn't want to go out. I didn't want to open my mouth around people. I started getting scared. There was a turning point when I decided to change my habits in order for me to feel better. I was smart enough to realize that there's always going to be haters out there. But actually, I loved my body. I just needed to find a way to embrace my feminine side within my gym life. So when I started gaining muscle, the type of clothes that I would wear, honestly, was like razor back, tank tops, shorts. Everything was black, G.I. Jane and militia. But never dresses, never skirts. But now, I wear all kinds of different colors. Before, I was so focused on getting where I wanted to get that fixing my hair wasn't important. Wigs is like an outfit. I love my wigs. Now, I'm getting myself ready before I go to the gym. I'm still gonna train hard, but the last thing you're gonna expect is this like bombshell coming in there squatting and template, you know what I mean? I just started paying more attention to myself. And even when I wear sportswear now, I would wear the workout clothes, but with heels on. So I'll turn that workout outfit into streetwear. My style now is the best it's ever been. <laughs> Okay. My babe cave. Where would I be without my babe cave? I don't know. Like, I'm so lucky to have a babe cave. You walk in there and everything is, you know, your favorite color. For me, it needs to be pink, white, red, you know, anything that makes you feel happy. This is officially my babe cave spa where all my feminine dreams come true. How do you like it? When I am feeling very, very, very stressed out or a little overwhelmed with work. I get into my femininity and I get into my zone. Now, it's time for my self-pampering. If you guys don't mind, you ain't gotta go home, but you gotta get the fuck out of here and let me get it together, right? I'll be back. Bye. There's plenty of things, like, to be feminine. This right here, it actually takes a lot of puffiness. I just rather use the blocks of ice that's on here right now just to apply all of that under my eye. Under your eyes is so important as a woman. You want it to be firm. Oh my God, it feels so good. It's like a never ending world. Before coming more feminine, I really didn't do makeup. I bought makeup all the time, never used it. This is one of my new favorite dresses. It's very feminine, very sexy, very bold. And it lets you know, it lets all the men know and everybody in the room that there's a woman in here. Now, I can get all the attention. You can look at me now and say, whoa, she's strong, but dang, she's pretty. She's cute, or like, oh, what's up? I'm very, very, very happy where I am. It's really important because femininity is power. It's power, and that's your crown. You can be strong and be beautiful. 